Turner to be followed by Jody Maynard and her campaign manager, Kate Mullaney. Please give them your undivided attention. <laughs> Good morning. I'm Claire Payton Bowman, representing Leslie Donaldson. As some of you may know, Leslie is very picky about cleanliness, so she will keep your microwave super clean. She has many qualities of a good treasurer. She has been grocery shopping for her parents since the seventh grade, so she knows all the greatest buys. On the matter of handling purchase orders and receipts, Leslie is well beyond her years wise. The blood drive is a project that is very close to her heart, and she promises next time to give. Maybe. <laughs> Please put your trust in Leslie D, and our SGA Treasury will surpass the others. Thank you. High school family. I'm Leslie Donaldson, and I'm running for SGA Treasurer. Coleman High School has been my home for almost three years now. The faculty, staff, administration, and students have given me opportunities that I never want to take for granted. Coleman High School has allowed me, as well as each of you, the opportunity to learn, to explore talents and interests, and to excel. I feel that it is now my duty to give back to the school my final year here. During my senior year at Coleman High School, I will be honored to serve as your SGA treasurer and grateful to serve as your voice as we make decisions to maintain the high standards of our school. Your trust in me to manage the allotted funds would be greatly valued. I will do my best to carry out each responsibility placed upon me to the best of my ability. I hope to continue the tradition of Coleman High School being a place we are proud to call home. Thank you. A few days ago, one of my best friends in the entire world, Jody Manor, asked me to be her campaign manager. And I was like, what's a champagne manager? Anyways, <laughs> she explained it to me, and being a good friend, of course, I said, no way. I will not, under any circumstance, be your campaign manager. But Jody is a very persistent person. So I agreed, under one condition. I said, Jody, I'll be your campaign manager if and only if I don't have to give a speech. <laughs> so, here I am. If you didn't already know, I was disqualified from the SGA officer elections because I was late to the meeting for the second year in a row. <laughs> so, having nothing else to do and wanting to make amends for my lack of punctuality, I agreed to the job. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to tell you what Jordy Manfred can do if you, if you vote for her for SGA treasurer. During this election season, we hear a lot about change. A vote for Judy is a vote for change. If you come to Jody to the five and you want four ones and four quarters, she will give you four ones and four quarters. If you want a ten, a five, and five ones for a twenty, that's exactly what you'll get. <laughs> if you want a five, four ones, three quarters, two dimes, and a nickel, she'll give you a five, four ones, three quarters, two dimes, and a nickel. That's the kind of change I'm talking about. <laughs> if you empower her to be your treasure, your life will change. <laughs> <laughs> I love vitamin <fighting> water. <laughs> anyway, I have here a list of reasons to vote for Jody. So here, ladies and gentlemen, are the top ten reasons to vote for Jody May. Number ten, Jody is very good at math, which is a quality of any good treasure. I know personally that Jody has never made less than an A in math or any subject on her report card. Number nine, if elected, she will divide the money collected for lunch each day amongst the student body. <laughs> Number eight, if you elect Jody, she will wrestle a bear. <laughs> Polar, grizzly, panda, 
koala, dummy, whatever you want. It's the entire single one. That's my phone issue. Number seven. She'll have J building renamed Jody building. Why not? Number six. Jody has seen National Treasure 12 and a half times. Of course, she left during the middle of one of them to go do something leaderish. <laughs> Number five. Jody has spent ample time with one of our very own past SGA treasurers, Connor Johnson. I'm sure he taught her all the keys to success while being a treasurer during their time spent together. <laughs> Number four. If Jody is elected, she will, not, she will not hold a grudge over the baseball team for busting her rear windshield out. <laughs> Number three. One of her toes is extremely longer than her big toe. <laughs> that signifies leadership. <laughs> Number two, as a tribute to saving money, Jody will give every student a ringtone by 50 cent. vitamin water. And the number one reason to elect Judy Maynard, if she can talk me into doing this, she must be a very persistent person. If you want a persistent treasurer, vote for Jody. But seriously. In all seriousness. If you want an intelligent, honest, hard-working person as your treasurer, vote for Jody. I know. I know she will represent us more. Thank you. As you know from Kate's speech, I am Jody Maynard, and I am seeking the office of SGA Treasurer. Nothing would make me happier than receiving the honor of becoming your 2008-2009 SGA Treasurer. I believe I'm the best candidate for this office because I've been involved in SGA and a variety of other organizations, so I've experienced with the task at hand. I could list accomplishments to sway you to vote for me, but that's not what matters. What does matter, and the reason you should vote for me, for your SGA Treasurer, is that I will vote myself to ensure that each one of you has direct input in the SGA at the school. I respect and value the views of my peers and believe that these values should be recognized. I promise to remain approachable to anyone who has a concern. And finally, I believe I can keep Stevie and Tyler in line, but more importantly, I will uphold integrity and dignity in office and prove to you that your vote matters in high school and life after. Thank you.